Now casting. Here at Soul Garden, we are looking for two things, knowledge and personality. Now, now casting. casting. Are you a crystal expert? Do you know astrology? Do you know romance? Do you see dead people? Do you know numerology? Now casting. Are you a psychic? Do you know tarot? Psychiatry? Ancient masters? Yoga? Astronomy? In a nutshell, I'm looking for experts and talented practitioners who can help our viewers' soul garden grow. Now casting. Email me. I'm Jackie Shakta, Director of Casting at SoulGarden.tv. Hello, my heroes, and welcome to Friday. Thank goodness it's Friday. Thank goodness it's Friday, huh? My goodness. We made it. Six weeks. Three eclipses. Today is the final day. Today we are in chapter one of Sun and Cancer. And the Sun is ruled by Mars. And as of midnight, Pacific Standard Time last night, it all came to a climax while we were sleeping in the United States. So the, uh, that side of the world was getting it subconsciously. And then the other side of the world, Asia and Europe, were getting it consciously. They were awake during the eclipse. Nonetheless, it was hopefully a healing that has begun and will continue now. A healing to create the Taj Mahal. I think that's the best way to put it. It's now time, Aries, to move forward, to take action today with Mars ruling the day. That is your home planet. Action is what you do best. Whatever it is that you like casted yesterday, act on that now. Follow through. If the universe shows up with a door that opens that looks like it might lead to what you want and it feels good, act on that. And for the next week to 10 days, it's now time to build the Taj Mahal. All right, and you should have a lot of energy and feel really grounded in the next few days. In fact, the moon is in Cancer and then moves into Leo. So we go from sunny nesting and resting for you today and tomorrow into inner child through the 4th of July here in the United States. So good times, good time to heal. Now, why am I speaking like I'm talking into the future? Well, it's because I'm taking next week off. That's right. I want to let you know I will not be doing the horoscopes next week. This is your official warning. I would have told you earlier, but frankly, I just wanted to not worry about, worry you because <laughs> the energy was intense. I want to wait till we got past the eclipse to tell everyone. So I will be taking next week off. I need to go fall through and create my Taj Mahal. But next week, we're actually going to have new content coming out for everyone on YouTube and in the garden. Next week is Soul Nirvana Preview Week. In other words, we're going to show and release some of our greatest Soul Nirvana shows, general public, so you can take a good look at what Sol Nirvana has to offer. And I won't have the horoscope, so you might as well take a look. So next week, Carolyn Nagel, our full moon goddess, will be hosting as I take a week break. All right, that's all I have for the week, Aries. I'll see you in Sol Nirvana, and if not, I'll see you when I get back in a week. Have a happy 4th of July. Make sure you make that Taj Mahal, and live, love, be. Soul.